Did you know that Aguila Ammo is one of the largest ammo manufacturers in the world? And Mark, you guys have a full line. Yes, we make a full line of ammunition from shotgun ammunition, center fire, pistol and rifle, to 22 long rifle. And our 22 long rifle ammunition, we have the most variety of any manufacturer in the world. And you're making a lot of it. One billion rounds a year. <laughs> That's a lot. Now, the good news is we've opened up operations in Texas, so all of our 22 long rifle ammo is gonna be available in ball ammo or hollow points. So 22 hollow points. Correct. And you do have a wide variety. I mean, you've got high velocity, subsonic, and, and you know the hollow points for hunting. Now, what are you guys doing with the pistol ammo that's being made in Texas? Well, the good thing about the pistol ammo is that we are developing hollow points for defensive, as well as our manufacturing more ball ammo, but we're mating them together. Okay. Meaning that our ball ammo is gonna be running the same bullet weight, same velocities as our defensive ammo. So when you're practicing with ball ammo, your gun's gonna run reliably, point of aim's gonna be the same, gotcha. the felt recoil's the same. Then when you load up your defensive ammo for when you're on the street, everything's the same. Consistency's the way to go. Well, and you were also telling me that there's something special about the nine millimeter, 147 grain. The 147 grain is probably the most popular choice for action shooting for two reasons. Okay. Number one, I got more bullet weight hitting a knockdown steel target that helps the steel target go down. Right. But the second reason, which I think is the most important, is I have a softer recoil impulse. It's more of a push than a snap. What that translates into is a much faster recovery time so I can shoot accurate shots quicker. Let me show you. Okay. Now, I bet you that would work on even training with your little concealed carry gun, Absolutely. too, right? All right, let me try this out. Yeah, <laughs> I can feel it. So, 147 grain, a push, not a shove, a little bit more bullet weight, knock over those steel targets. Nothing more fun than 22s with a suppressor. Right now we're shooting the fast 40 grain round. Listen to this. But if where you are, you don't, you can't own a suppressor or you just don't own one yet, let me show you something that's kind of cool. You know, these subsonic rounds from Agula are pretty neat. Let's start off with the super Sniper subsonic, okay? 60 grain bullet, and it is subsonic. Listen to this. Pretty quiet. Now, if you want to get really quiet, let me show you this. The Super Calibri, okay? This is gonna be really quiet, and it's gonna run in a bolt gun, it's gonna run in revolvers. It won't run in a semi-auto. Can you believe that? That is quiet. Now the point of impact changes quite a bit on something like this, but a couple options for you if you wanna shoot quietly with 22s from Aguila. 